I'm just going to review how to change the main jet and the slow or pilot jet. Uh, different carburetor manufacturers will call the slow jet or it's a pilot jet. It does the same thing. Uh, if you're lucky enough to have this nut on the bottom of your bowl, it's great because you can get the main jet out really easily. And you don't have to take the, the bowl cover off. Your main jet could be a hex style like this or a round. Uh, if you do not have that nut. Then we've got to take the float bowl cover off and you usually have two or four screws holding it down. When you take the cover off you want to be careful not to bump or disturb the floats and get them out of adjustment. Again there is the main jet right there and take it out and you would just replace it. A lot of times I see people uh, send in comments that hey I bought this jet it doesn't look like mine. They'll take this jet out and they'll also remove this brass piece underneath it so they'll end up with a long jet like that. Just be aware that that can happen and your pilot jet or your slow jet is right there. Different carburetors will have them in slightly different locations but for the most part all the carburetors are very similar. And there's your pilot jet or slow jet and you just replace it with the size you want to use and reinstall. When you tighten these jets up you don't want to tighten them too much just get them snug. They won't come back out. And reassemble in the opposite order. Thanks!